Hey guys, what is up? Jared Ultimatum. I have to keep it down a little bit. Everyone's sleeping, but, um, great toy haul. Um, of course, got the new camera out, so you guys should see more uh, high definition videos. And I got the reviews coming. Um, me on toy hunts, uh, me with friends, me at yard sales, all kinds of cool stuff. So, all that's coming just takes time and money, <laughs> especially money. I got so many toys, you're not going to see them all because I don't want to make a 45 minute, 60 minute uh, toy haul. I'll just skim through it, give a few people shout outs, um, had a lot of fun, uh, met some new people and uh, got a lot of cool stuff, actually too much. Um, so I went to uh, this new friend, his name is Tom, he's on Arkansas Toy Collectors, we had a little gathering, there was about seven or eight people there it, I mean it's more than what usually happens I mean it was it's not a swap meet it's just like a local friend gathering and um, I was there and uh, let's see Otis I got stuff from him Zach uh, David um, Ian my friend Ian and Julia <laughs> of course she helps me um, and I have a lots more coming in the mail so I've, I want to do toy hauls for the next ten years probably <laughs> <laughs> but uh, from David, um, I got this Costco exclusive Transformer Cybertron uh, reissue, but it's uh, Robots in the Skies, uh, Optimus Prime. Okay, so I'm not really used to this camera. I don't really have a wide view like my other one. So I'm going to hold them like this, which is kind of weird. And my arm, it's like bent. <laughs> but yeah, we'll figure that one out. So I got a... Um, Fire Convoy, I think that's what his name was. Oh, also got uh, Magnus, Ultra Magnus. I'm just going to call this one Magnus. There's just nothing really ultra about them. They're okay figures. Um, never had one of these before. I always dreamt of having these since like 2000, 2001. And I finally got it. They're okay. I mean, there's not much more I could say than that. They kind of fall apart, to be honest. There's those. Um, I got like 10 of these bags. Um, I, I did a trade with a random guy. Turns out he had some good stuff, and he, he was cool, uh, but it was all on, on the spot on, right? like on the moment. And like, okay, we're in this gas station parking lot. Let's hurry up and trade. And I really didn't look through everything. And then I really didn't organize all my stuff. So we had a rush, you know. Uh, but I got a big box of uh, binocles. I got like 10 of these bags. And But there's a lot of stuff in there that was trash. Uh, there was connects. A lot of just random garbage I don't need. Um, so yeah, I had, a big, I had a big box. But there's a lot of uh, rubbish in it. But I did get at least 10 of these. I traded them some comic books I didn't need. So I think I, I think I had a pretty good deal. And I think I got a lot of other stuff from that guy. They're just kind of mixed in. Um, yeah, this was in there. This was Rock'em Sock'em Robots. And uh, coincidentally, I bought this big Ziploc bag full of Rock'em Sock'em Robots. So I could put them together. out of the way now we have the big box um, today now these are really really rare I just saw them on Facebook and stupid me I posted about it and my, my other local friend he's like oh man I gotta go check them out so he bought the only sky warp turns out there's only one or one of these figures per case so there was one sky warp I missed out on them uh, cliff jumper yeah so there's him and Ultra Magnus. Now, when you guys are watching this video, this might be the first ever Transformers Combiner Wars. Eh, let's see, 2000. Wait, they don't have dates on these. 2014. Okay, it's supposed to be released uh, last year. So, anyways, um, Transformers Combiner Wars style packaging, uh, but they're, they don't call these legends. They call them legions. So uh, this might be the first time you guys see these on YouTube, which is pretty cool. Nothing much to say about them. Hopefully I'll get Skywarp soon. 
hopefully. So here's these. Um, from Otis, I got this uh, Shakunabu from the Fast Forward series. I never had them. Fortunately, this was opened, um, and there's a weapon missing. I might take them off the card. I got this bootleg Pikachu. It's pretty cool. This one's going right on the desk. I love this one. Um, oh yeah, I got these from Jeff. Um, I forget Jeff's last name. I got two Ben 10 figures. I traded him some stuff. And 6-6. Six, six. I forget this guy's name, but this one's 6-6. Six, six. I think. <laughs> Um, I got a little Arby's, little knockoff Transformers, little Rhino. Uh, He-Man, I lost the sword to him, it's somewhere. This one's up for trade or sale. Uh, forget this guy's name, it's the, the vintage one. Yeah, look at that guy. <laughs> Wait, I can never do this. <laughs> there we go. I like this one. I think I'm already have like 10 of these, so this one will be up for trade. Um, and then I got the 2001 or 2003 version. This one's really awesome. Never had a chance to get those when I was younger. Uh, I like this one a whole lot better than the other one. I might, I might be keeping this, to be honest. Um, oh yeah, um, this random guy on Facebook, we traded. I haven't sent his stuff yet, but he was really cool, and he made sure these didn't get uh, broken. I think these were called Star Readers, or Star Warriors, or Space, now some generic name. You've seen these before. They're like the Soma robots. Uh, these are the hard plastic ones. These are really cool. I have these in chrome. I have these in all different colors. I might have a complete set. Who knows? We'll check that one out. I got a little um, Jawa from Ian. Ian's such a great guy. This one's pretty cool. I don't really do uh, a lot of... Well, okay, I'll take that back. I have a lot of Star Wars figures. But they are uh, clone troopers, uh, droids, stuff like that. I don't really... And, you know, some Jedis and stuff. I don't really do out of that uh, era of... Um, figures. I don't really collect a lot of other figures. I'm trying to say, but I'm, I really like this one. <laughs> I might keep him. I don't know. He's okay. I might keep him for a week or two, and then I'll change my mind. <laughs> um, yes, Otis. Otis is a pretty cool guy. He hooked me up with this one. I don't remember what series this is from. It's a uh, Turbo, maybe? I don't know. It's a good figure. And I have two other Red Rangers like these, but with the same muscular structure. They're the same figures. These are really cool. I like these. Ah, I got this baggie from Buddy. Don't really remember what's in here. I like pieces. Anytime I find a Transformer, I grab it even if it's incomplete, because someone like Buddy will have the rest of them. So, I finally got this Cheetor. I heard it was good. I heard it was bad. But he's missing his tail. If you guys have a tail for this, I really need it. And there's just some random stuff in there. Um, Power Ranger? It's okay. Ah, sh excuse me. I'm really gassy today. <laughs> uh, Street Shark. I don't need this one. I think. Let me double check. If I don't need this one, uh, if a local guy doesn't want it, it's going on eBay. So there's that. These are these do pretty well for me. I like these. Ah, this one is an okay figure. I thought it was a different one. Um, it's an okay figure. If I already had this one, he's up for trade or sale. Uh, I got uh, a few met on card vintage turtles. I got um, April. Which one is this one? The Ra Ravishing Reporter, mint on card. Card's a little messed up, but it's having a uh, having a complete. You know, it's better than nothing. Uh, Tune Irma. I might be cutting this one off the card. 
So there's that. Uh, I'll have a second Irma for trade or sell. So there's that. Um, Shogun April. Pretty neat. Oh, I think I smashed this one. <laughs> That's weird. All right, I got a little set of Pogs. I have an addiction to Pogs. I like them a lot. So there's that. Um, this guy. Don't know who he is. I don't need him. He's I rescued him for you guys. From Buddy, I finally got a complete Classics Prime. Uh, I have a second one. I might I might sell my other one or trade. Um, haven't decided yet because I'm thinking about getting the uh, third party add-on kit and having uh, one regular prime and then one uh, ultra prime or you know whatever they call them. So there's that. Uh, another binocle. Like I said, I have a butt ton more binocles. I need to organize them all. It's gonna take me a few weeks because I have like thousands of binocle pieces. Legos, Lego Technics, all kinds of stuff. <sighs> yeah, so that's a that's a long project. But then I'll be doing more mocks once I organize them, clean my apartment, <laughs> sell off a lot of these extra toys um, I don't need. I'll be building a lot more binocles. So there's that. Oh yeah, me and my friend Shannon met up. Um, went to Game Exchange. I never have anything. Uh, finally got Armored Core 3. By the way, Armored Core 5 sucks really bad. And then I found the first Armored Core. The case is really messed up, so they gave me another uh, little case. I'm going to swap out the graphics. A uh, little random bag. Let's see what's in here. A uh, little Exo Squad guy. Pretty neat. Um, strong arm. I think this is the first release of strong arm uh, before the universe and before the uh, Sector Seven, the the movie ones. Never had this one. He doesn't have the wheels. If you guys have his wheel, it goes on his axe. I like that. Um, an extreme dino. Hardly ever find these. Otis picked this up for me. It's a really cool guy. Uh, the Omega Lock for Primus. Ian picked me that up. It was thanks, dude. Uh, Transformer Pretender. Don't need him. Uh, my nephew Gavin got me this little creeper. <laughs> I like Minecraft, so there's that. I think this was Clocker. I could be wrong. A little red repaint of him. If you guys have parts to him, he's missing a little flap on his leg. Uh, the cyber key, another uh, exhaust pipe, his gun. If you have pieces for this one, let me know. Uh, Terminator. Don't need this one. Uh, Ian picked me up this little Ninja Turtle little buggy. He got me a bike, little chopper. Uh, a lot of random stuff in the bag. I uh, found these. I think this is a Borg from Star Trek. Uh, this dude, forget his name, and this guy. <laughs> so I, I've posted these for sale. I just absolutely don't want them. Uh, picked them up in a bag. It has some stuff I want. But if you guys want these Star Trek figures, take them off my hands. I don't. I don't need them at all. Um, three Power Rangers. A local woman on Facebook picked these up. They're like a buck a piece. They're okay. I just like to have an army. I have like a few hundred Power Rangers in a box. I probably actually already own these. <laughs> Who knows? Uh, did a trade with a guy. Got this little Beast Wars figure. Uh, my friend Zach. Uh, I'm not bragging. I am. 
I really hate that I do this, but I got such a great deal I have to explain. Okay, so uh, a few toy hauls ago, I got two Marvel Legends in a bag for one dollar, fifty cents a legend, right? So I got an Electra for fifty cents. Didn't need her. Zach's such a cool guy. Traded me this uh, Sound Blaster Mitten Box. It's basically a fifty cent transformer. Wow, what a great deal! Thanks, dude. Um, uh, I have the Blaster and uh, Soundwave. I uh, wanted this uh, figure, but it comes with a new data disc, uh, Buzzsaw. It's, it's the coolest thing ever, so thanks, dude. Finally got him. Um, my friend Calvin from the Batcave, he's a pretty cool guy. He has lots of toys, and I broke this one. <laughs> he got these from a local anime con um, and I think visual j-rock I've met them before at a comic con way which these local cons I'm trying to film some more for you guys we'll, we'll see which one's good which one's not but I'm not knocking on anybody um, I love all these local uh, conventions I uh, wish they could be bigger and better if you guys are locally check Arkansas toy collectors it's only open for Arkansas residents. All the cool people are in there. And Calvin got a lot of these little uh, Gundams. I broke this one. Got me like five of them. Um, yeah, they're cool. They're really cool. But I don't feel like digging them all out. So <laughs> there's that. Uh, found a little army ant. I have a lot of these. I've been thinking about selling my, my Bakugans that could bring me a pretty good chunk of change. Um, I just have so many of them. I find them all the time and um, just don't need them anymore. Found another army ant. Same thing with these. I have a lot of these. I don't really want to get rid of them, but I need the money. I need the room, you know. Not to sound desperate. Um, I found two Marvel figures. Uh, don't need these. Um, found a mini con. I got this from Star Toys. Uh, it was broken, and uh, I was out the door. And he's like, "Yeah, just take it." And uh, he's like, "I'll keep the Gumby." <laughs> so I traded a Gumby for this. Um, it's okay. If you guys have another one of these, I need them, please. Uh, one Pokemon. Actually, I got two. The other one was broken. Um. Knight's Kingdom by Lego. I use them to build my binocles. What is that? And uh, just this little handful. I guess that's all I have left. Really love Ben 10. Never found them. Found these bags of Ben 10s for like a dollar. You get three Ben 10 figures and all this other garbage. I just put them in a bag. Take them to Goodwill. Get me a <laughs> discount coupon. I'm helping people. So anyways, can't beat these for like 33 cents. Uh, still don't know all their names. I'm really bad with names. This one's an okay one. I think I already have this one. Uh, this one's pretty cool. He's like half translucent, which I have something to say about this one. There's a uh, person in Conway, Arkansas. There's a thrift store. Don't remember the name of it. They have these uh, Ben 10 figures mint on card right just the coolest thing ever right and there's these um rare ones with quotation marks they want thirty dollars for these that's insane i would never pay thirty dollars or more for a ben 10 figure i just love ben 10. Uh, i got this one from otis it's okay uh ghost face he's missing his chest and this one I'm really bad with names. Um, oh. Okay. So if you remember this guy from a long time ago. I forget the name of these. I found some more. Uh, got these on Facebook from Gigi. She's pretty cool. She has lots of toys. So got this little power chair and a little 
little spider thingy. They're cool. I love smalls. Um, oh, there's a quarter gu uh, gumball machine on these little donuts. <laughs> I like a little small stuff. But yeah, that's about it. I didn't get much more. Uh, just some little random pieces in my my box, and I got a lot more in there. I just feel I don't feel like pulling it all out. Um, so yeah, stay tuned, guys. Uh, catch me at facebook.com forward slash Jared Ultimatum. And I have. I haven't really been posting much. You might see a week or two go by, and I'll you know throw a little toy haul up. But I'm really working on um, a lot of projects. I'm working on what I can with Ubuntu. Uh, it's an open source uh, free software operating system. Uh, I'm learning, I'm trying to figure out how I could broadcast to Twitch. I really want to do more gaming. I'm trying to get a better computer. Uh, I'm trying to get a better game capture um, device and, and a better camera this camera is good it's a good camcorder but it doesn't do wide you know like my webcam it doesn't do you know a wide view and that's I'm just working on a lot of projects so just stay tuned um, hopefully like the little animation at the end of the video that took me like phew, a couple days <laughs> and um, yeah you guys are awesome I will be having contest so a lot of these extra figures I don't need they'll be up for grabs and I might even grab some more rare figures like I don't know that Ultra Magnus you saw if I find a couple be handing those out um, Combiner Wars, uh, Girl Toys uh, Aquarium videos, I, I still do aquariums all kinds of cool stuff so if you guys like free action figures stay tuned help me get up to the next uh, what is it 400 subs I'll be handing out a lot of stuff. So, thanks for watching. Gerald Ultimatum. Never stop collecting. See you later.